us now. <laughs> Stage Fright. Watch it now on iTunes before it's in theaters May 9th. It's super heightened in terms of the, the kind of slasher element and the musical element that come together. It's a super kind of rock slasher movie. Stage Fright is a horror musical that takes place at a summer camp for the performing arts. Be safe. Prepare it for opening night. Rehearse all day. It's almost been perfectly right. It tells the story of Camilla Swanson, who is a kitchen hand who slaves away as part of the kitchen staff at the camp, but secretly dreams of being a Broadway star like her mother once was. I think about Mom a lot. Maybe this is what I'm supposed to do. You actually want to compete with those theater geese? Those kids aren't normal, kid. Your mother's role. She would be proud. As rehearsals begin for the show, it soon becomes clear that they're not alone. It just so happens the person who's stalking them hates musical theater. Break a leg. Do you think this is connected to your mom? There has been an accident. I like the character of Roger McCall so much and, and how complex he really is. Ah! Maybe there's somebody out there that really doesn't want him to put on this play. My master summons me. This movie is probably my favorite project I've done so far because it, it has everything that I'm good at. <laughs> In one movie, I'm good at singing, acting, and screaming. No! This movie's weird, dude. I like it because of that, because it, there is that aspect of it. It is a true horror movie. Isn't it wrong to sing and dance when someone just died? There's a lot of blood. There's more blood than you could ever imagine. And there are really insidious, dreadful ways in which people die. Camilla, where are you? There's a killer here! You're constantly being shifted between being truly scared truly grossed out, finding something truly hilarious, feeling uh, a, a truly heartfelt feeling for a character, and then back to laughing hysterically at something, and then vomiting. Stage Fright. Watch it now on iTunes before it's in theaters May 9th.